Hi, I'm Chris, and today I'm going to give you a couple of tips on how to come up with a secure password. So in one of our other tech tips, I showed you how to set up a password in Windows 8 on a Vega 3 Pro. Today, we're going to make sure that the password that you choose is going to be one that's secure. So to start off with, a good rule of thumb to follow when trying to come up with a password is that you're trying to create something that can't easily be guessed by someone else. So this would mean avoid using personal information such as your name, nicknames, date of birth, anything that can be associated with you that someone that knows you might be able to guess. Another thing to try to keep in mind is to avoid using just simple words. So if your password is just one word, and it's, it's not very complex and it can easily be guessed. You should also avoid using just simple patterns as a password as well, such as one, two, three, four, five, six, as it's just not very secure at all. So when coming up with a password, you want to use one that's complex enough that no one can guess, but relevant enough that you won't go forgetting. So here are a couple of tips on how to achieve that balance. So on our road to ending with a secure password, we're going to start off with a simple, insecure password, and then try to make it more complex. So we'll start off with a password that actually comes up as one of the most common passwords year after year. Password. The first tip is try to come up with a password that's longer than five characters. The reason for that is anything that's five characters or less is pretty easy for a computer to crack with in a reasonable amount of time. Secondly, instead of using a simple word, you can use sentences or phrases all compounded into one. Such as instead of password, you can use this is a password. Just as easy to remember, but much harder to guess. My third tip would be to substitute some of the letters into numbers and symbols. That way it opens up to a lot more characters and a lot more combinations which is make it harder to guess and harder for a system to solve. So in this case it's like changing the is into a 1 and a 5 and the a to an at. So it's still the same phrase, just spiced up a little. My fourth and final tip would be to use alternative spellings or short form. So in this case it's like changing password into just pw. This way, you've added another layer of interpretation and complexity to it, whilst retaining the simplicity of the original phrase. So as you can see, it started off with password, one of the most common passwords that are used, to something a lot more difficult to guess. That, those are a couple of tips to help you come up with a secure password. If this tech tip helped you at all, please give it a like, and if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. For more tech tips, please subscribe. I'm Chris, and thanks for watching.